Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Garmin VivoActive 3 music tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add Spotify to your Garmin VivoActive 3 music. Real quick, before we get started, this does require Spotify Premium, so it's going to cost you some money to be able to do this. But if you don't have Spotify Premium, check the description because I'll add a link to where Spotify has it so you can sign up for your first month for 99 cents. And my last point is that there's a lot of people complaining about having issues downloading the actual music from Spotify to their Garmin VivoActive 3 music. The one way to improve that is to connect your Garmin View Active 3 music to a Wi-Fi network. It's really easy to do and I'll have a link in the description for a tutorial on how to do that as well. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you need is your phone because you'll be installing the app using your phone. So once you're in the app here, all you need to do is select the menu at the top left, then scroll down until you see Garmin Devices, and then actually select the Vivo Active 3 music. So once we're in the Vivo Active 3 music, we need to select music. Once it loads, select the bottom button that says Get Music Apps, and then select Spotify. Once we get into here, go ahead and download Spotify. Now that we've downloaded the app, all we need to do is press the back button right here at the top left. Keep doing that. And then select this little sync button at the top right. That will manually force the Garmin Vivo Active 3 music to sync with your phone and install the app. You should see this on your Garmin Vivo Active 3 music once it's been installed. And then to access it, all you need to do is swipe up. It should be the first widget on your Garmin Vivo Active 3 music. But now we need to download some of the music from Spotify to your watch. So to do that, we need to go back into the Garmin Vivo Active 3 and select the music again. From the music section, you should see that Spotify is installed. Go ahead and select that. And then we can select Manage Music on the Vivo Active 3 music. Log into your Spotify account and then simply agree to give access to Connect IQ in Spotify. All right, so once we've signed in on our phone and Garmin has access to our Spotify account, all we need to do is go to the widget and then select right here for your library. So in here, we can actually add music and podcasts to our phone. You do that by just tapping add music and podcasts. So in here, you have the option to add playlists, recently played, made for you, workouts. I'm gonna actually just select a couple playlists. So once we get in here, just select the playlist you wanna add. So once it actually begins downloading the playlist that you've selected, it'll come up with this syncing Spotify and show you percentage of the completion. It does use a lot of battery, so I currently have it plugged into a power bank. And I do recommend having your watch connected to a Wi-Fi network for faster speeds. Now, another really cool thing is you can actually scroll down and download podcast. It actually will have your list of podcasts on your Spotify account. So you can go in there, download specific episodes of your favorite podcast, which is really cool. As you can see, it's gonna look for a Wi-Fi network and then it will start downloading the podcast. So from the music widget, you can see what music you've have downloaded by just selecting the library button, and then it'll show you the library of one podcast and then a playlist downloaded. And then they actually play the music, just go into your library, select one of the playlists that you've downloaded, and then you can press play. As you can see, I have it connected to a Bluetooth speaker. Change songs, works very well. To change the volume, all you need to do is select the three dots in the bottom right there, then you can select the volume right here. You can lower that, you can raise it. You can also put it in shuffle mode and also in repeat. If you select the name of the song up here, you can also see how much time is left. And it does show a progress bar around the perimeter of the watch. As you can see, if you're listening to a podcast, it gives you the option to skip forward and backwards 15 seconds, which is very helpful with most podcasts. Very cool. All right, so that's how you set up and then use Spotify on your Garmin Vivo Active 3 music. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Garmin Vivo Active 3 music tutorials, check the link in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up, and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.